Rivers goes forward. Imagination up for Carroll. And we're set to go the seventh. First to pick six today. Bunny rolling up. Favourite steps to three. Mint collision. Racing. Mint collision only fair today. Bit of early speed out wide here. Sasha's one will dive for the lead. Along the inside comes Mint Collision now. Tucked in beside them. Imagination. Off the track a little is Pint Star. Followed a couple back by Thrilling Punch. Then we go to Sip and Tequila Twin Rivers. Last is Thrilling Chill. Off the top they come and Sasha's one starts to step away. Now Sasha's one. Down on the paint there is Mint Collision out wide of the track there. Now two Imagination. Sasha's one still kicks up getting home. Mint Collision Sasha's one. Mint collision. Pint star. Out wider would have been Twin Rivers. Tucked in beside them. Imagination. Back there sipping tequila. Tail of the field there was thrilling punch and thrilling chill. Just kept going off the eight. Did Sasha's one. Getting home in the first of pick six today. And just kept kicking, kicking and kicking a little bit more. Uh, for Stephen Kath. Just floated out under a little bit of pressure here. Uh, but it's done enough. We, we'll beat the three. That was Mint Collision, the seven. And who else do we have there? The four. Eight, three, seven, and the four. As we go to the post, 31 and 14. Running was 15, 23. First split, 485, mid, 15, 91. So 485, 15, 91, 15, and 23. Just jumped out, all right. Just got a little bit of a tickle up there by the six and the four, but she's cross going into the first bend. Mint collision down on the inside. Just missed away today, but had every chance. Got a lot. So a lot of ifs and buts here. All but set. Race eight. Bunny rolling up. Set and ready. Racing and getting off nicely here was Hot Lass. A bit of speed too there with Martin Street and out wider there is Exciting Girl. Looking for a bit of room there. Corborn Steffi. That's followed wider out there by Will Cup. Miss Big Time Lucky Opawa Dole. Off the top they come. Martin Street, Hot Lass, Lamar's Lady in between them. Martin Street's found. Martin Street home. Lamar's Lady. Then we go to Hot Lass. Followed out wider there by Exciting Girl. That's followed there by Corborn Steffi. And uh, towards the tail of the field, we would have had World Cup Miss Opawa Dole and a big time lucky. Martin Street off the inside. Will it do it? Yeah, around about sixes and two dollars and fifty cents. It was one of those races. Certainly needed a spread. No excuses at two. It's bounced and led. Ended up being your favourite. I see hot last three eighty and one dollar and eighty cents at Big Martin Street. He just pushed along the inside. I'm seeing Glennis Farrell in the winner's circle for a while. I don't think she's training too many at the moment uh, to get some here with Martin Street to beat the three. Lamar's Lady the two. A hot lass and the five exciting girl, 18 and 70. Was the winner's time off the top split 463. We'll get the post run in a moment or two, but gets there a good length and a bit uh, in the end. April and a pampist. Crafty Graham thrilling charge, hot pooty and Electra Fantasy off the wide. Last couple go up. Thrilling charge in. Green light flashes and bunny rolls so for the Thornton auctions. Set ready. Just about there. Racing, seeing excuses, stood astride. Bit of early speed here coming with Hot Pooty and out wider. There we go to big Electra Fantasy drifts to the lead. Electra Fantasy, Pampas, uh, I should say Electra Fantas uh, Fantasy. Then we go there to Hot Pooty. Crafty Graham third. Fall back there we go to. Here he is. That's followed along the inside there by Thrilling Charge. Trying to kick round the outside there to Pampers. The tail of the field seeing excuses. Thrilling April off the top. They come and Electra Fantasy. Here comes Hot Pooty. Electra Fantasy will win from Hot Pooty. Uh, followed across now by Crafty Graham. Thrilling Charge back there now to Pampers. It's outside. Would have been seeing excuses. Taylor's coming in. A thrilling April. Here he is. The eight. The six. The two. Uh, as uh, they've gone to the post here. And a nice win, Electra Fantasy. Backed up that good run at uh, Cambridge the other day and uh, tightened up from fives to about 380, I think, in the end. Has uh, scored nicely here. Uh, Hot Pooty. It's getting out of the boxes a bit better lately, isn't it, Hot Pooty? Another good run there. And it wasn't going to get to Electra Fantasy uh, today. 8, 6, 2, 4, 30 and 50. Ending force. Monsheraz match in Shin Alley Funk. Box and set race number 10, the real fishing.com. Set and ready. 
And racing, Beatrix Kiddo up with a little bit of speed coming here with Moncherez and out wide of the track. There we go to Fancy Toby. Moncherez, Fancy Toby, their match motors. Third posse there is ascending force, followed round there by a winsome right. Try to kick round the outside as Ali Funk and Beatrix Kiddo drops the tail. Off down the back they go. Moncherez tracked hard there. Kennel mate, Fancy Toby. Gap in the field there to uh, ascending force. Ali Funk followed the rail there now by Match and Chin. A long way from them. Winsome right, Beatrix Kiddo. Up they come. Moncherez, Fancy Fancy Toby, Montserrat's Fancy Toby. Followed across here now by ascending force. Further back was Match and Chin, and behind them there would have been Ali Funk. Gap in the field, uh, Beatrix Kiddo, and Winsome Wright was last. Montserrat's the two over the three, the seven. As they've gone to the wire here, he had just uh, found the lead and just kept kicking. Uh, we caught late at Cambridge the other day by Kennelmate Mint Power, but uh, today uh, Montserrat's found that lead and just kept finding, finding, finding. Fancy Toby, no excuses for him. Never get a better chance uh, to win a race than that one there today. And they wouldn't have run that much time. What have they gone? 31 flats. So They're not exceptional. Uh, they at 31, 237, and the four here. And we'll get those run ins. So 482, 1579, and uh, the run to the post in a 15 and 21. Here they are from the lid. You see the one went up with the lid, and basically she extinguished her chances there. Uh, but getting across them are the two, the three, they made play in front. So that second line about to come forward. Aston Red goes up. Outside Gems. And we're just about set to go. The yourselves TAB of uh, Mungari. And a bunny rolling up for the 11th of the day. Favourite to one tough cookie. Off the three. Set and ready. Racing, speeding off here was Nathan's champion out wide of the track. There we go, two gems, one tough cookie trucks in behind them. Then we go to Corball Mads, followed a couple back there by Aston Red. Triple T with a play. Back there, thrilling Bolton. Last of all, they're exemplified. Off the top they come, just waiting for the gap as one tough cookie. Nathan's champ still there, but here comes a cookie. One tough cookie. And uh, then we go here now. We've got uh, Aston Red was there, gems was there. And also up there, uh, we would have had, who was the other one there? Nathan's champ was still there too, wasn't it? Thrilling Bolton got to the line A-OK -okay up wide on the track would have been triple T and uh, towards the tail of the field of crossing it was exemplified uh, back there but one tough cookie your short price favourite doing the job to beat the two Aston Red the eight gems and the one Nathan's champ three two eight and one eighteen and fifty nine the winner's time he just sat beautifully uh, in behind them all the way today did a one tough cookie what he does just waits for the rail and he got the rail swinging in and away he went uh, splits for 4.58 and uh, to the post in a 14.01. Yeah, once you saw that uh, daylight along the inside, they weren't going to catch. Hey, good run, Aston Red there, wasn't it? That's at the line uh, there. And in behind there was the Corborn Mads uh, there, 3.281. As they've got to the post, 18.59. Those splits are 4.85, 14 point, uh, 4 uh, 58, I should say, 14.01. Look, he just sits the rail there, doesn't he? That's where he wins his races. to second line going forward and we're about set to go the last of Jack's wholesale meets bunny rolling up race number 12 good luck to you holding tickets on pick six today set and ready Racing, getting away up wide there. Moon Warrior showing up there too as Glow Bell Dolan in by charging off there. Blue Jean Alice has found the lead. Blue Jean Alice to the lead from Ali's Girl back there in third posse. There is Glow Bell Dole followed there by Don't Know the Rail there too. Go to Crow Moon Warrior and last of all there, safe and secure. Up they come. Ali's Girl drives out wide, gets home. Ali's Girl, Blue Jean Alice. Then we go back there now to Don't Know Glow Bell Dole. Out wide of Moon Warrior up there too was safe and secure and go to Crow. Was the back there as well. I think you'll find, as it just got up the last hop, number nine, it's close, very close. The nine and the five, the five and the nine here. Uh, just leaned towards Sarah Alley's girl, just uh, getting in the last hop uh, there. And off the ballot today, and uh, has it done the job? Let's have a look here. Just uh, think it has got home. Here we go. Um, into the B and the five, the blue Jean Alice in front, and here's the nine starting to lengthen out here now. Uh, Ellie's girl, long way back. There we go to Glow Bell Doll. Don't know. Up they go. Nine, five, four, and three. Eighteen and sixty-two. Splits four, sixty-six, and to the post thirteen and ninety-six. The five leads them in. That is a blue Jean Alice. But here is Ellie's girl stepping up over the top. 
and head up, head down, Yoa gets home nicely, doesn't it? Uh, good long neck or so uh, in that uh, time of 18 and 62 for the uh, Regan Kennels by Big Sand Jr. from Black Alley. Here they are from the Hot Moon Warrior, disappointed once he doesn't lead, he spits the dummy. And uh, look at the squeezing up here, the three, the five comes out in front here, little Alley's girl just hops onto the backs of them and it got there by a neck by six links, a neck by six. And